Hello viewers, what's your favorite scary YouTube video? Hello everybody, it's me the Prince of FNAF and uh, tonight we're going to have a look at this ghost face reaction figure. This is from a series of reaction figures to do with the horror franchise, more importantly called classic horror. Now featured in this series 2 of horror reaction figures, it featured Ghostface as seen here, Eric Draven's The Crow, uh, Sam from Trick or Treat, Michael Myers from Halloween, Freddy Krueger from Nightmare on Elm Street, Jason Voorhees from Friday the 13th, and it featured a lot of uh, good classic horror movie villains. So don't go away, we're going to roll the intro, there's more figure review to be had. So for any kids watching, um, this is the kind of action figure that your parents had. If you have any parents or grandparents that are, you know, older folks and you show them this video and just keep in mind that, yeah, this is the stuff that your folks had back in the day, you know, different compared to the stuff that uh, we have nowadays went from four points of articulation to a fully articulated figure. I'm talking about you, eight scale Demogorgon. So yeah, action figures have very much evolved in the past hundreds of ye year, well not hundreds of years, in the past a uh, couple years that we have had these. But uh, pretty cool. So here we have the, like I said, the reaction figure ghost face he holds a knife and it just loosely fits in his hand which bothers me and like i said back in these days there was only four points of articulation and you'd be lucky if they came with an accessory and they were much smaller than the action figures nowadays but uh pretty cool you can see this is ghost face from the scream movies uh, he's wearing his cloak, and he's got the, of course, ghost face, hence the name. And he's got his little hunting knife. Uh, yeah. You can slicing up all kinds of people there. He's got his, uh, or an attempt at making his combat boots. But pretty cool, and he's got the hoodie on his back, you can see there. But yeah, this is quite nostalgic for those of you older people who are watching uh, with your kids or whatnot. But, like, yeah, this is uh, the kind of stuff that, like, brings people back. It's uh, very nostalgic, and this is basically a retroactive figure, much like the retroactive figures we looked at, the three-pack, which featured the It characters. That was NECA taking their take on stuff like this, the retroaction figures. So pretty cool. Um, he does have head articulation, arm articulation, and his legs move. So yeah, pretty simple figure to articulate. Not as, you know, complicated as what you would have with the McFarlane Toys 8 scale Demogorgon. Or you just know basic figures nowadays. But pretty cool. Hope you guys enjoyed my review of the Ghostface reaction figure from the Horror Series 2. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next spooky Halloween review. Happy haunts.